you spend your holiday week caring for that turkey, making those great mashed potatoes, making great stuffing, cubing that bread, and then it comes time for the cranberry sauce, and we all know that can that just goes right down in the middle of the table. I'm going to show you a quick, easy way that it's going to make that cranberry relish just as special as the rest of the meal. This recipe starts with some bourbon. To that, we're going to add some golden raisins, some dried cranberries. Our final dried fruit is our diced dried apricot. Uh, for this recipe, any of your favorite dried fruit cut up in small pieces could substitute. Our final ingredient is our favorite jellied cranberry sauce. This came right out of a can, and we're going to add this to our other dried fruits. All we have to do cooking-wise is just bring this whole recipe to a boil. Then we're going to chill it, refrigerate it, and it's ready for our table. This is a great recipe to make the day ahead because it has to be totally chilled when you serve it. So it helps to get even further ahead on that holiday week. As you can see here, this is our finished dried fruit and cranberry relish that looks nothing like that can of cranberry that's been on your table for years. Happy holidays and enjoy.